Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to give you a short introduction of our renewed web product configurator. There are two ways to use the BEAS web product configurator. An API is available that can be integrated into the websites of customers, or we have a simple out of the box solution that you can use. I'm going to demonstrate the second one. If you have an item with a configuration definition in your system, it can be further configured in the web solution. It is possible to create and cancel sales documents, log in as a customer or as a sales employee, and depending on the various settings, the user can view and manage sales orders or quotation lists. To start using the web configurator, you need to perform the following steps. 1. Create a BAS service in the BAS Many server and enable the web application server. 2. You need to create login credentials for the user. You have possibility to log in as a sales employee and as a customer. For the sales employee login, you need to add and store login information in the BEAS personnel editing window. To log in as a customer, you need to add information for a contact person in the SAP Business One Business Partner Master Data window. Provide a contact ID, email address, and a password. Upon login, you can use the email and password that you saved here. You also want to make sure that your web product configurator is set up correctly according to your special requirements. For this, we have created a new window named Web Product Configurator Setup, which you can call directly from the program menu. Here, you can see the administration list of all apps of the web solution. Click on Basic Setting to access the settings of the Web Product Configurator. The settings are grouped regarding the visibility of items and the accessibility of document management functions. With the first group of parameters, you can set which items can be viewed and selected by the user. With the document management parameters, you can allow the creation and or cancellation of sales documents, make groups of orders visible to the user, and have the system write various UDF descriptions in SAP documents. Once you have set it up, you can start the web product configurator. The home screen and the overall look and feel has been redesigned to align with other streamlined Boeing products. In the collapsible menu found in the top right corner, you can work with all functions available in the app. On the top, you can find a welcoming message with logged in customer information. If you have logged in as a sales employee, this screen section will prompt you to select a customer. This you can perform in the home screen. If you would like to log in as a customer, you can do it so by providing here the customer login credentials. According to the filter settings, you can access various products with configurations that you can add to your cart. Once you added the fresh configuration to the cart, the cart automatically opens, listing all products that you created with the web configurator. The menu also indicates that your cart contains one item. Besides the added configurations, the cart view itself contains the various customer information coming from SAP Business Partner Master Data, and you can also add your remarks. If enabled in the settings, you can create a sales order or quotation here. From the collapsible menu, you can also access a list of sales orders or quotations, which you can filter by document creation date, and you can log out to log in another user. For further information on the various settings, please visit our documentation page. Thank you for your attention, and please stay tuned for our upcoming videos.